Just a young girl with a quick fuse. I was uptight, wanna let loose. I was dreaming of bigger things and wanna leave my old life behind. Not a yes sir, not a follow up. This Woody and um, I'm headed here to South Carolina trying to get on uh, some uh, flounder real quick. Oh, there's a little pond over here, salt pond, and see so we pull up. Welcome to South Carolina. There you go. I'm in South Carolina right now, so going to see if we can pull up some uh, some flounder or redfish using the mud minnows and hopefully catch some mullet bomb out there and see if we get some on some of the flounder. So we'll see. Stay tuned. Alright y'all, we finally made it to our destination here. Right here. Let's go ahead and uh, see if we can catch anything. Let's see. Just let y'all know, I didn't get skunked. I got a flounder right here. Whoa. Yep, I got one. He's about one inches long. All right, y'all, just trying to cast for some, uh, oops, cast for some, uh, mullet. I just got this baby redfish right here. Two spots, him back in the water. We got the, another flounder right here, baby flounder in the middle, middle net. Still trying to catch him, y'all. All Oh, it is a... Oh, golly, it's a trout. It's a trout. Hey, y'all, it's a trout. Whew. Hey, y'all, it's a trout. Oh, my gosh. Golly. I didn't even see my barber go down. I thought it was a big old flounder. This surprised me. God dang. Whew. This is probably my PB trout. Might be. Look at that. Look at that, boy. He be trout. Look at that one tooth right there. Man, suck away about, about three pounds. I'm gonna go ahead and wash it off so you can get a better view. Look at that. Man, I'm so happy. I caught him off a of, uh it was a mullet. I caught a mullet and threw it out there with my popping cork. And this is what I got, y'all. So I'm gonna go ahead and set him in a cooler. And take some pictures and stuff. Alright? That, that made my day. If I don't catch nothing else, I'm happy. That's what I got. Okay, y'all. I got something else in my mind. Alright, y'all. I'm about to bring it in. Line food, rock. I don't know. Is it still on there? Probably, yeah, dang it. I missed it.
Čakov rádně. I uh, just to let y'all know, this is what I'm using for bait. It's called a finger mullet. Mullet get way bigger than this, but it's a, it's live, so I'm about to hurry up, put it on the hook. And this is what I caught the trout off of. Finger mullet. All right, y'all. I hope y'all enjoyed the video. It's getting dark, and I'm about to head home because I gotta go see my daughter for her birthday. Happy birthday, Erica. See you tomorrow. So I'm gonna go see my daughter for her birthday. She'll be uh, 20 years old tomorrow. Yep, but uh, yeah, had a good time uh, fishing today. Just had to get it out. Just was uh, messing around. It's a, as you see, I had to stop the camera because I, I got to get rid of the bee. So. Yeah, I'm about to get on out of here though. And I hope y'all enjoyed the video. And till next time, talk to y'all later. Okay, the trout is close to 21 and a half, almost 22. Yep, about 21 and a half, almost 22 inches. So that's how much this trout is right there. Yep. Big old monster. So I'm about to go ahead and put them in the oven. Alright y'all. Here's the fish. It's all seasoned up. Ready to go in the oven. So I'm gonna preheat the oven to 350. So ready to go. And we put it in the oven. All right, here's the final outcome of the fish. Baked fish right here. It's all done. It's out of it. Ready to eat. All seasoned up. So how does the fish taste? Fish good? Yeah, the fish is delicious. Good.